Hello guys, welcome on Tesla Adventures. Today in this video, we'll be discussing a very important topic of projectile motion, which is safety parabola. Many students have requested me on Facebook and in fact uh, YouTube and on uh, offline mode, my offline students, uh, to make a video on the safety parabola. So here it is and let us start now the safety parabola so you can see that in projectile motion uh, if i am projecting these projectiles at different angles but with same speed all are projected with same speed let us suppose that the speed of projection is v but all are projected at different angles you can see so you can see that there are many common points which are common for two trajectories. You can see that. These points are common for these two trajectories which are intersecting at these points. So we can say that these are the common points which can occur for both trajectories. Okay. But you can see uh, that there are only single points on this outer envelope. Okay, so at which these trajectories are intersecting. So on uh, this outer envelope, no two trajectories are intersecting with the, each other. And in fact, there are only one common point of each trajectory on this outer envelope. And there are no point on any of the trajectory outside this envelope. Okay, so this envelope which is covering these uh, all trajectories is called as uh, safety parabola. Okay, so this is very important uh, that what is safety parabola? Actually, this name uh, has a significance that uh, water sprinklers in garden are uh, sprinkled at all possible angles. So if we need to be, if we need to save ourselves from that uh, water, so we can uh, see that we have to be in a region which is outside this safety parabola. So that would be the safe region. Okay, so we have to find out the equation of this safety parabola. So let us see that the trajectory equation of uh, this parabolic motion or projectile motion is y is equal to x tan theta minus half g x square upon u square and this is sec square theta and you can also write it down as x tan theta minus half g x square upon u square 1 plus tan square theta now let us imagine that we are talking about any one point this point x comma y so x and y are known to us okay so these x and y are known and we have to find out the equation of uh, this uh, angle theta we have to find out this angle theta for x and y so you can see that there could be two values so if i talk uh, about this region so in this region, region 1, uh, the values of, there are two values of theta. In region, on this safety parabola, on the circumference, on the circumference of safety parabola, there is only one point. Theta has only theta has only one value and uh, in this region region 3 or region 2 <coughs> outside this safety parabola theta does not have any real value <coughs> okay so let us find out uh, the value of this uh, theta which lies on this safety parabola so let us solve this equation of 
quadratic equation of tan theta for a single value of theta. So first of all, uh, we are assuming x and y as constants. So y, in fact, uh, <coughs> y is equal to x tan theta minus half g x square upon u square minus half g x square upon u square tan square theta. Okay, so uh, to convert this equation into a quadratic equation of tan theta, we can see that g x square upon 2 u square tan square theta and minus this is x tan theta and this is plus half g x square upon u square plus y is equal to 0. So we can see that this is A and this is B, in fact, with the negative sign. This is B and this complete term is C. So you can see that this equation becomes A tenth square theta and plus b tan theta plus c is equal to 0. Okay, so this is the quadratic equation of tan theta and its roots would be tan theta is equal to minus b plus minus under root b square minus 4ac by 2a. So if we if we are saying that tan theta should have only one value, if tan theta should have only single value, then b square should be equal to 4ac. Now b is x minus x, so x square should be equal to 4 and a is g x square upon 2 u square g x square upon 2 u square and c c is g x square upon 2 u square plus y g x square upon 2 u square plus y so cancelling this u x square with x square 2 u square in fact it is u square by 2 g is equal to y plus g x square upon 2 u square and y will be equal to u square by 2 g minus g x square by 2 u square. So this is the equation of safety parabola. Now let us derive this equation with one more method. So this method is a different one. So let us imagine that this is a uh, inclined plane of some inclination alpha. And you can see that from this point all the balls are projected and uh, this ball has the highest range, this one. So we know that the maximum range on the inclined plane is u square by g. 1 plus sin alpha. This we have already derived and uh, this is our most pro popular video of uh, our channel. So this is the maximum range uh, on the inclined plane and if we see that if we suppose that this distance is r and the coordinates of this point is x comma y. So we can see that r is equal to u square by g into 1 plus sin alpha. So r into g into 1 plus sin alpha or we can multiply that r plus r sin alpha is equal to u square by g. Now r sin alpha, r sin alpha is equal to y and r cos alpha is equal to x. So this is r plus y is equal to u square by g 
and r is equal to u square by g minus y square okay so r can be written as under root of x square plus y square so under root of x square plus y square is equal to u square by g minus uh, this is y okay minus y squaring both the sides x square plus y square will be equal to u to the power 4 by g square plus y square minus 2 u square by g into y cancelling this y square so you can see <coughs> that x square is equal to u to the power 4 by g square minus 2 u square by g u to the power 4 by g square minus 2 u square by g into y now if we take common then we can say that u square by g is common and it is u square by g minus 2y and this is x square into g by u square is equal to u square by g minus 2y so 2y is equal to u square by g minus x square g by u square and y is equal to u square by 2g minus x square g by 2u square now you can compare this equation with this one u square by 2g minus gx square by 2u square u square by 2g minus gx square by 2u square so this is the required equation of safety parabola okay so this is the equation of safety parabola and let me tell you that if you compare this equation with the general uh, parametric form of parabola which is uh, y square is equal to 4ax and x square is equal to 4ay then you could find the focus of parabola and you should always remember that the focus of safety parabola focus of safety parabola is always the point of projection point of projection of all the balls which is origin in this case origin in this case you could find out the focus by uh, the coordinates which you know about the parabola and you could see that this would be the focus of safety parabola which is the common point of projection of all the balls and let me tell you that this u is that common velocity with which all the balls are projected at different angles so this was the safety parabola thank you